All right, so I am back, and today we're going to take a look at the uh, Transformers Titans Return Rewind figure. So here he is in his um, mode. Um, you can see there's stickers here, um, horribly aligned and kind of peeling off, and in general not looking so great. Is that a sticker too? No, that's not a sticker. Um, and yeah, so it's just one of those little thingies. <laughs> I don't really know what to call this thing. Um, if you do have the, um, Titans Return Blaster, you can just slide this in your chest and close it up and you can store it. Uh, you can only store one, but he can store it just fine. Um, but yeah, that's that's really all there is to this um, mode. So what you want to do here is pull out the gun here, we'll transform it into tank mode. Um, so this comes up. Collapse those like this. And then this will just come down. Here, there's a little slot section here that this will slot into. And then you can take the gun and it just tabs in just like that. And now we have a tank mode. If that's what you really want to call this. Um, I'm sorry, this this is just kind of stupid looking. Um, doesn't rotate turret doesn't rotate um, it's got a wheel here here and here so it kind of rolls and that's really all there is to it so let's get them into bot mode uh, there's really not much to this guy um, fold these out and down like so flip the legs around this and then you can flip these forward and they become his feet open up the chest and you can flip the head around close this up and you plug his gun into his hand and there he is in his bot mode um, and this by far is his best mode um, his head is on a swivel um, there's a hinge up and down uh, rotator or ball joint uh, shoulders on a ball joint hinge at the elbow bicep swivel um, hips are on ball joints knees are on ball joints and then the foot does have a little bit of a pivot I have a hard time keeping these feet actually in the figure um, but other than that he uh, you know he does a pretty decent job being a rewind right rewind I am having a hard time today uh, there he is with another legends figure um, a seeker prime and unique toys blaster so I think I think he works pretty well um, in this kind of scale, uh, yeah. If you put him here, uh, I, I'd still say he, he works well enough with this one. Me personally, I, I kind of like this look better. You know, it's like uh, I have the music label Soundwave, and I prefer in piece um, the MP uh, cassettes with him as opposed to you know smaller ones or like the data disc. Um, it's it's okay. The data disc mode or whatever is terrible. It's absolutely um, terrible. I mean, it's just. I mean, this is the little slug that comes with uh, the leader class blaster, and it's just it's just. I mean, it's it's boring, is what it is. It's nothing exciting going on there at all. Um, his tank mode is. Ugh. His bot mode is pretty decent. Um, all in all, I, I think 
I, I think they're trying to make the Legends figures, you know, better than they were, but they're kind of hit missing the mark because of that. And, and that's really unfortunate because the Legends were some of the best um, they had to offer for a long time. So, anyway, uh, I think I'll give them a um, 7 out of 10. Um I mean, it is a legend, so, I mean, there's only so much they can do with it. And I think it's it's decent. Um, I'm, I'm hoping we get the eject from him. And, you know, with any luck, uh, a new Rumble Frenzy. Um, but I'm not going to really, you know, really want the Rumble Frenzy. I just hope we get the... Uh, e I want eject and rewind. And I want them to be the same mold, so... So that'd be cool. So uh, I guess that's it.